Hey guys, what's up? This is K9 here, and this is going to be how to make a cool channel intro just using Photoshop. So it's just going to be a standard image uh, in Photoshop. So this is a graphic design tutorial, and welcome guys. So this is going to be how to make something just like this here, uh, using the text tool and a like flare or lighting effect that I'll put it on my DeviantArt page, so you guys can download it. So first of all, you want to go download that. So when you've done that, you want to click File, New, or press Ctrl N. Click 1280 by 720, and this is the size of the YouTube videos, like I said before. So that the image will fit the whole video set green, and there'll be no black borders on the outside. So we want to make sure that we have our color of black selected. Press Alt Delete to fill our background layer with black. Create a new layer and grab your text tool and I'm using Far Cry th Far Cry text at 150 part but if you go through and pick your favorite text so you could pick this or this or whatever and you just want to draw a box out type your username or your, uh, your channel name or whatever or whatever you want in your intro so you could have like welcome to blah 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 or hello this is a tutorial blah, blah, blah. whatever I'm gonna just have K9 designs if I can type so just like here K9 designs I'll type K9 designs just drag it down to the middle and then click on this layer twice to bring up the layer style you're going to want to tick a gradient overlay and you're going to want to pick your gradient as the standard one that's given and I'm going to turn it on to 54% and then click Okay, everything else the same. You just use the black to grey gradient. Click OK. I'm gonna then double click on it again and tick out of glow. And for this I'm going to double click and change the layer or gradient mode to this. So this is because I've picked a blue color for my text. You may have picked a different color, but you'll want to select that color that you've picked for your text to black. And click OK. I'm going to change the opacity to 100% and click OK. So now you can see that we've got this cool sort of protruding lighter bits from our text. And that's exactly why I chose this text, because it looks really cool with the uh, outer glow. So now that we have all this stuff open, I'm going to open our flare image, which I've saved in my textures. So for you, it's going to be in, in your downloads. If you want to find it, here it is, open. And I'm just going to grab the marquee tool, draw a selection, press Control X, go to my K9 Designs bit or your username bit pick the layer, turn the layer mode onto screen then grab the eraser tool and just go around and erase all the hard edges so around here and just put it so you have something that's sort of like this with no hard edges a design like that so I'm just going to move this down onto our text and I'm just going to take out all of the, the lower part and then duplicate this layer Okay. change this layer mode, the first layer mode to I believe it is uh, let's have a look I think the layer mode is vivid light Okay. so you can close this the layer mode on vivid light 
which is um oh god here there we go that took a while and just drag it down and I don't like how it's lighting up all of this so I'm just going to grab the eraser and erase a tiny bit of it and just center this however you like that looks cool to me and then on the duplicate of this layer that you made we're just going to take out this black bit in the bottom you want to drag it up so it's about here grab the eraser tool and just erase that section there so your final product should look something like this or something like this Either way, you may have chosen different colors to me, but that doesn't matter. So yeah, this is just a quick tutorial, so you can make a channel intro. If you also want, you can have something at the bottom, so for each time you do a new video, say you do a gameplay, you can type K9 KOD channel intro gameplay, or whatever you want to put if it'll let me maybe type text let's try it on this one there we go so you can put K9 designs gameplay and have the same kind of uh, style with it using the same font or whatever just changing it up whatever type of video you made so this may <coughs> or you may want to make a couple of these at once just using the same image and changing the uh, text so for me I do mostly uh, graphic design so I don't really need to put design or anything but you might, you might want to put gameplay underneath or something like that You'd also then do the same to this layer if you wanted to, where you could leave it like that. And also, if you had this in 4D Cinema or After Effects, whatever, you would use this as like the base image, I guess, and then have animations for it coming in or the flare f flickering or whatever. But this is just a simple JPEG image that you can put in front of your video editing software. So I will show you that. I'll just save it as K9 Designs and I want to put it as a JPEG so scroll down and find JPEG click save and 12 sign minimize Photoshop this is the new background by the way start your video editing software this will work for Vegas uh, Premiere Pro, After Effects, whatever. I have the trial for Premiere Pro, but I don't really know how to use it. So, shh, quiet. So, what you want to do is just find your image, drag it in to the timeline, put it down. I'd say have it for about five seconds. And then here we can see our image is in front of the video. You then place your video in this section here. So you'd edit it and uh, commentate over it or whatever. So yeah, this is how you make your channel intro for your YouTube videos in Photoshop. This isn't like a 4D cinema or anything intro, this is just a simple picture that you put in front of the video. And I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks.